Now, in reality, I haven't used the courts, the mobile court or the accusation thing for years because I know I know my authority now. I don't need to get a, a verdict from a judge. I know who I am. Therefore, I know how to use my authority to deal with any opposition. In the, in back in the day, or... I didn't. I didn't know who I was. And therefore, I was coming into my identity. And therefore, it helped me to deal with the things that were blocking my identity or had accusations against me because of my lack of knowledge and my lack of understanding of who I was. Mm -hmm. When yeah. I knew who I was, that, that, that deception wasn't able to function. Therefore, I didn't need to go to the judge and get a, get a verdict because I knew my verdict. Right. You know, so I've used that less and less as I've matured into my identity. And it was part of my rite of passage in coming into sonship. When you're in sonship, I don't think you need the, that court in the same way. Of course, I've used other assemblies and courts which are judicial and legislative and are part of the kingdoms out working and how to establish things and get things, you know, put into the records of heaven and things like that legislatively which I think still function. Um, but again, even that, when you know who you are and you know as a son of God, you carry authority, you tend to just outwork that authority in a sort of everyday way rather than, well, I'm going to go and get a law to enable me to do this. Well, actually, I'm a son. I have the laws on my half. And if I need to decree something, I can declare it Right now, I don't need to go and get a law to help me declare it. Yeah. Whereas before, I would go and establish something, but I was doing it on behalf of others as well. So they could use those laws because they probably didn't carry the same level of understanding of who they were. Mm -hmm. So, you know, and that is valid in, in our journey. But ultimately, I think it becomes more relational the closer we get to the father's heart to outwork the father's heart and that's what i think i've discovered when you're close and dwelling and abiding in the presence of the father he reveals his heart infuses that knowledge to you and your intentions and desires are aligned to his heart which enables you to outwork his heart right i was seeking to go and find his heart within the courtroom of heaven or within the uh, court of judges or whatever i was i was seeking to outwork his find his heart that was before i was dwelling continually face to face in the realm of light and perfection engaged with him heart to heart mm -hmm. so again i think they were all relevant on my journey right and they're relevant on other people's journey because right. you've got to get there in a yeah. sense you've got to yeah. get where you already are you know from yeah. god's perspective you're already there but there's a sort of a unfolding journey that gets you to understand who you actually are and where you're actually positioned. If you enjoy these videos, would you please take a moment to like, comment and subscribe? It really does help. Thank you very much.